Right, afternoon everyone. Um, today's Tuesday the 2nd. And it's uh, nearly 10 past 3 in the afternoon. Now, last night and only this morning, I made a plaster mould. Um, I should have left it for a few days actually for it to completely dry out, but I was too impatient to give it a go today. And uh, it didn't work. It, it kind of like just fell apart on me. So I will make another one. Um, I don't know if this plaster is any good to be honest with you. Um, but I will give it another go. I actually tried um, making this last night as well. But trying to get the wood out was ridiculous and it was breaking up completely. So um, the reason what I was doing there was to um, make some like smaller ingots. So uh, I'll just leave that there. I might be able to do something with it, I don't know. But the other one just completely fell apart. Um, so the lead that I got from Bobby yesterday, I've made into ingots. And I've made 16, no 17 fishing weights. These ones are actually copper ones. They're not like the ones I made last time where there was like smaller on one side and bigger on the other side because what I was doing I've now actually sussed a way to doing it is if I put A on that side and A on that side and put like an arrow then I know exactly what side I need to have the mould because what I was doing I was doing it that way as well as that way and they was just coming out completely fucked up so give me a second, I just want to get this my little plastic mould grips completely melted so I need to get some more I have got some but I think they're too small so we're going to weigh these ingots see what they weigh if I don't keep hitting the damn video recorder turn off so there's the um, scales Right, so this one, I don't know why, but they still keep sinking in. I don't know if that happens to everyone else. But that one is 627 grams. 6, 2, 7. Now, bottom's pretty good. It's just the top bits that keep coming out crackling. Uh, this one, again, nice bottom on it, 622. This one, I tried to get them all around about the same weight this time. Uh, this one's 649. And this one might be around about the same. 705 actually, that one. And the smaller one, it's probably about 100. 274. So 274. Fishing weights, 45 gram. Thirty-five. Forty-five. Fifty-eight. I think I should have run about sixty. 32 32 34 no 33 32 these are all approximately 30 grams 
32, 36, 56, I'm not going to write them on. That one's probably 56, 57. So these are supposed to be like 55 gram probably. 35. Six forty five thirty six and thirty four. So, for some reason, I've got more of the smaller thirty threes than I did with the other ones. These are supposed to be like thirty, I suppose, these are thirty five. These are 65 and these are 50s. So, um, not bad, I suppose. Um, I'm not going to write the weights down on them. Uh, what I might do later, probably to, if I'm not going anywhere tomorrow, is melt some of these crappy ones down, like so, because they didn't come out right. Um, is 86 grams that one where the bloody thing's broken off oh no it's on that side 67 gram And the other ones I think I do need to remelt for these. So there's probably about two, four, five, and there might be some in the refreshing box. I might. I think I need to uh, remelt about seven of them down and make them proper. Uh, you know, I could use them myself, I suppose, but no, I'm not too worried about it. Um, <clears throat> so I don't know how I'm going to make a proper mould. You know, my own particular mould um, for me actually to make on my own fishing weights. So I've got like all this um, plaster here, which I'm going to take out in the garden a bit. Um, I've got everything here. Um, just ain't got too much room in here. I've got to sort this kitchen out as well. Um, I don't need all these weights straight away, but I will take a couple down extra to give to some of the guys. And if they want to know where I've got them, I just say I've made them. If you want me to make some, find me some lead and I'll make you some. Because I ain't going to be keep giving too much stuff away because it is costing me in getting lead you know all like the last 10 kilos the three and a half from bobby and the six and a half from one of the commons was totally free but um it still cost me money going up and collecting it and hunting for it you know and uh battery cost on a milk detector milk detectors run out of battery power so i need to find some batteries i think i've got a couple here somewhere so um yeah no i would like to like have a nice little um stock of lead so when i get bored i can just make some more fishing weights you know or um some other kind of stuff uh, i'm actually trying to look for some copper as well so anyone knows anyone who's got some copper uh i wouldn't mind trying to melt some copper down if that'll work or not, I don't know. Um, I've actually got the um, battery um, power adapter for that other thing I've got, which I'll quickly go and get and show you.
So, <clears throat> I don't know if you remember me doing a video on this. I couldn't do a review on anything on it because I didn't have anything to power it up. But I went to Argus and I got a packet of these. Get a packet of three for $9.99. Um, now, when you, if you ever do decide to buy one of these little solar things, yeah, the, these plugs won't fit in straight away. You have to pull the plug, like, you know, pull it out a little bit, and then it'll actually fit in there perfectly. So, um, but they were a bit too far in. And I'm thinking, well, like, you know, I can't get a damn thing in. Why can't I get it in? I thought, well, if I kind of like pull it out a little bit, maybe it'll work. And it did actually work. But I've not used it yet. So, um, I'll probably have a little muck around with that for some time. But I don't feel like I can move tight out of the way. Some more stuff. Um, that's going to be okay. You know, it is like a soldering pot. It will melt lead. Uh, you'll probably need like a little spoon to, and make that into like a ladle. Um, and then you can just pour some leads in your little mould, you know, instead of like heating shit loads up. So, um, just notice I've got more plastic. This is melted plastic for my clamps. I will probably buy some more um, of these, but when I don't know. Alright, that's it on the kitchen, guys. Cheers for watching. Ciao for now.